Are you curious about interstate commerce and how it impacts local trucking operations? Today, we are diving into the world of interstate trucking, covering everything from regulations to the benefits and challenges of running a local trucking business. Intrastate commerce refers to the transportation of goods within the boundaries of a single state. Unlike interstate trucking, which crosses state lines, intrastate trucking is regulated by state-level requirements. These state regulations can include restrictions on vehicle weight size and service hours. For example, some states have different weight limits for intrastate vehicles compared to interstate ones. Intrastate carriers may also need specific permits or licenses from their state. In addition to state regulations, intrastate carriers must comply with federal laws that apply to all commercial motor carriers. These include safety regulations, drug and alcohol testing, and commercial driver's license requirements. Now, let us talk about the different types of intrastate hauling. Local delivery services involve transporting goods within a specific metropolitan area, often using smaller trucks or vans. In-state long-haul trucking involves transporting goods over long distances within the same state, often using larger trucks. Short-haul trucking typically involves transporting goods within a 50-mile radius and delivering them to distribution centers, warehouses, and retail stores. For instance, short-haul operations might have different hours of service regulations compared to long-haul operations. Intrastate trucking offers several benefits like Shorter hauls can mean lower fuel costs and less vehicle wear and tear. In-state long-haul trucking can provide steady work and a reliable customer base. Additionally, local trucking companies can build strong relationships with local suppliers and customers, increasing efficiency and profitability. However, there are challenges too. State regulations can vary widely, creating logistical challenges for companies operating in multiple states. Interstate trucking operations may also face competition from larger interstate carriers with more resources. Despite these challenges, many interstate trucking companies thrive by focusing on local markets and developing strong customer relationships. Starting an interstate trucking business requires careful planning and consideration. Understanding state-specific regulations and the benefits of local operations can help your business thrive. Do not forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel for more valuable insights. Visit our website movingauthority.com or call our trucking experts at 702-333-2430 for personalized assistance. Moving Authority Association. We have been helping people in the trucking industry for over 20 years. Let us help your company today by calling 702-333-2430 or visit movingauthority.com.